I'm by my Nama Jusa, N-A-M-A, -A, because I was given an idea that I had thought about before, but I kind of blew it off because everybody was doing it. And I don't really follow a trend, so I never have. And my supervisor gave me because he knows he, I come across the threshold of the job with some sort of something that's vegan, juice, salad, something. He said, well, why don't you make a video of juicing, making juices? I said, nah, nobody, nobody wants to watch me make a video of juice, juicing. You know, and I, and, and I said, I think about it thinking, no, I'm not going to do it. So I'm putting the, the juicer back together because every morning for the last nine days I've been making just juices, uh, consuming just juices, uh, and it's amazing. And I've been coming across a lot of amazing juice recipes. Well, tonight I wanted to show you a truly simple juice recipe. I've never had it before. I've never, I've never had this juice before. And it's gonna be you and me trying it. Well, me trying it, unless you hit the 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 uh, items and then follow the the recipe. But <coughs> we're gonna try it. I hope it's good, cause if it's not good, I'll still drink it. But I kind of want to enjoy the juicing because it's my only substance for the day for my tummy and my palate. Fresh and delicious. So hopefully it's good. So thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for that. For whatever it's gonna taste like. Thank you in advance. But I'm I am praying that it be delicious. Okay. So what I'm using, cutting up a whole honeydew. I'm hoping the honeydew will give at least 32 ounces of juice. I have no idea what it's gonna yield. I have no idea. A lime, of which I've cut half, because limes are very, very strong. I've already cut the honeydew. Okay, I've already cut the honeydew. I actually started the video before, and I was actually going to, you know, have you follow me in cutting it up, but I kind of thought that was too long. I kind of wish I had continued. But anyway, there may be other ones, right? This, tomorrow is always another day. Okay, we all know who said that. Okay. Now, the, I have basil and mint as well. So the basil and mint will go into my mason jars. It's 32 ounces, well, a little less than 32 ounces. Think about 30 ounces, okay? And it would go in here, right? First, I'm gonna juice. <clears throat> so what I have is my measuring cup. Put it right there. And I have my mesh that catches the pulp. Okay, I like my juice really smooth. There's some people who like pulp. You don't have to use this if you don't want to. If you want the pulp, just don't, don't strain it. Don't strain it at all. I like my juice smooth. Especially if you're, you know, you're, you're consecrating or you're cleaning your system. You do want the, the, the juice to be smooth enough for your stomach's not working hard to digest. You need to give your stomach a break so that the, um, the other areas of your body can be uh, looked at, you know, detoxed and such. So, you know, if your stomach is constantly full and constantly utilizing, you know, all the energy to digest, your other organs will be left to fend for themselves. So that's why it's always good to do some sort of um, fast um, uh, per year, if not per month. For me, I'd like to do it uh, at least juice once a day, once a, well, I probably juice once a week maybe and choose like a day that I'll just drink, drink juice. But any mojito, as you can see, I'm, I'm totally out of my comfort zone. Okay, so the cantaloupe is rich in nutrients. Okay, I, I 
If you're going to juice uh, fast, well, mine would be juice feasting because I drink a lot of juice, about no less than 50 ounces of juice a day, if, if what I'm juicing yields that, okay? Um, so the cantaloupe is chock full of vitamins and nutrients. It's vitamin C, B6, folate, vitamin K, potassium, magnesium, and it's, uh, it reduces blood pressure, okay? Uh, nutrients vital for bone health, go figure, in a cantaloupe. Not a cantaloupe, I'm not juicing. This is a honeydew. Okay, honeydew, this honeydew, guys. May improve blood sugar levels, like control blood sugar, uh, rich in electrolytes and water. So if you're doing exercising or whatnot and you don't wanna get sore, you wanna make sure that you're healing fast, honeydew. Uh, support, supports healthy skin, uh, supports the moon, the mu I can't talk. See, you guys got me in raw, in raw see? You guys got me in raw form, okay? Boosts immune system and promotes proper indigestion. Maybe I should change my voice. Maybe that would help me stop stumbling. Okay. So, but I'm not going to do that to you. I'm not going to do that to you. All right. Here we go. I'm going to turn the Nama juicer on. Nice. Not too loud. Just perfect. Here we go. Start putting the cantaloupe at the top. I don't even know how much this is going to generate. I, I, I have no clue. It may generate eight ounces. But guess what? If it does, cut up another cantaloupe. See how it's coming out that side? You see it? See how it's coming out? Falling into it? Out. It's juicing. It's 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 grinding it. It doesn't juice fast. When you juice items fast, it takes away a lot of the nutrients because it heats up the fruit. It heats up the vegetable. So you want one that juices slow. I think they call it masticating or something. Like masticating. You want one that juices slowly. Okay. So it get all. Oh, it might just generate. Okay, so not, not a juice. You see that? You see that? You see that? I've only put a couple of pieces of a uh, of cantaloupe in there. All right. I might have to do two two cantaloupe though. Okay. So it's, it, and it's uh, just slowly crushing. It's just crushing it. It's like it's going like that, just all around. Just crushing. It. It's just it's just rolling in and down and around. Okay. And I pull this old open. Exciting, it's kind of fun. Okay. And people are always asking me. I, I actually wasn't, like I told you, I, I wasn't gonna do it, and I said, you know what? Why not? Why not? I can help somebody start something new, which I do all, all the time anyway. I might as well. So this is what's left. And see that? This is this is that's probably half a cantaloupe right there. Look at all this juice. You see that? This is from not can I keep saying cantaloupe. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Forgive me. This is a honeydew, guys. Honeydew. All of this coming out of a honeydew melon. Wow. I need a, a bigger sifter though. 
because that's too small, especially when you have a lot of pulp. It takes a longer time to uh, sift. I need a bigger one though. Bigger ones are better. It'll make it drier. You have more space to kind of turn it around in open spots. Okay, take this over and rinse it off. With a bigger sifter, you most likely won't have to do this. You won't have to rinse it again to leave more room for more pulp to drop in there. All right. This would have been kind of long if I had let you watch me cut it, but that first video was really cute. I should have left it in the See, I, what happens when you're perfectionist and things, you just need to let things flow. Let things flow. I might just make one jar. I usually, one jar is like 32 ounces. I might make just one jar and just Okay, here we go. Open it up again. Oh, well, you know what? I'll put the rest of this in here. It's all the way up there. You see all that juice? This is neat. Okay, so sink. Okay, open it up again. I might put it through again, too. Let's see if I can get some more. Juice. Ooh, this is a lot. This is out of one melon. One melon. One. All of this juice out of this melon. This honeydew. And it's green. It's green. Mm -hmm. See? God knows exactly what he's doing, guys. Yeah, I'm going to put it through again. It may not even generate anything, but I'll, I'll see. Because he's still. If I can get some more juice out. Came out of that putting it back in. Oh. Put that pole back up in there. Oh, that's good. Pretty tasty now. All right. This is how much juice we got here. We have, this looks like about 30 ounces maybe. Because this is about as 30. Is it, what is this? This is 30, this is 32 ounces here, baby. I'm sorry, honey, I'm not even in the, in the thing. So focused here. So I'm just getting the rest of it out. And I'm going to re-sift it, too. I'm going to re-sift it. Just to make sure all... Well, I may not have to. It might, it might be okay. I just really like it really smooth. So my stomach's not... utilizing hardly any... Any energy. We gotta take care of our bodies. We truly do. That is that is that is our responsibility to take care of our bodies. The sovereign has given us these bodies to maintain. He didn't expect us 
to just live haphazardly with these bodies. We don't have to stay sick. You, you don't. You don't have to. If, if there, if there is a way, if there is a way. Here's some more. Here's some more coming out. Look at that. If there is a way, here's, here's the limes. Here's the lime. Here's a half a lime. I peeled it and cut it in half. If there is a way to change anything, to fix anything, why not? Why not do it? Not, not that much juice came out of that lime. Maybe that's a good thing. figured out maybe you know what I want though it's still fresh in the mind okay sometimes you have to taste stuff oh I kind of don't want to I kind of want it to be a surprise I don't want to taste it now I'm gonna wait I'm gonna wait jar. Okay. Basil leaf. So how many basil? How many do I want to put in here? How many do I want to put in here? I am going to put two basil leaves in here. Ah, uh, Lord, how much do I put in here? Okay, put one in here. And the lit and the mint. I'm, this is what I'm doing for me. I don't know. Well, and I'll put a swig. Hopefully. Oh, I'm out of. I'm out of. I'm sorry. I'm out of windows. I'm out of the, the thing. Okay. What should I put? Uh, what should I put in here? Okay. Here you go. Boom. All right. So that's the basil leaf and the. It's the basil leaf and the mint is already in here, right? There we go. See, watch me, watch, watch it spill all over the floor. See, watch. So that's what I need to do right here. Okay, here we go. Pour it in there. Pour it in there. Right here, Mama. Oh my gosh, I can't see. There we go. Boom. Yay. Yay. Oh, thank you, Lord. Perfect. It fit the jar perfectly. Father knows how to bless this baby girl here. He knows how to bless this baby girl. Okay? Perfect. Okay? I am putting this in the in the refrigerator. Okay? It's going to sit in the refrigerator overnight. Okay? And when I'm about to drink it, I will make the video and let you know what I think. Okay? Thank you guys for sticking with me. I hope this was a blessing to you. And uh, if you guys like it and you want me to make more videos, just let me know. And I will. I'm making a, another juice Sunday. Okay? So just let me know. All right. God bless.